A E M E S A P I N J U C O M P I L A T I O N t a t a s h i k u i e t e m o s h i t o ka? Um, choto mate. Sole wa henju des. Okay, let's do this. Don't judge a book by its cover is a beautiful, powerful sentiment that I fully ignore when book shopping. It applies to everything except books. Yeah. Oh, the vibe to live in a giant tree stump house. I got no good tags for the post. Just, yeah. Hey, bestie, come closer. I'm totally not going to drag you into my obscure interest, bestie. I promise. The cask of a Monty Blorbo. Imagine someone thinking of you and buying you flowers. Okay, now imagine a horse as a skeleton with a blue fire mane. That sounds cool. Open world Tetris. That's just putting away the groceries. If you think I'm going to sit and watch a six to seven hour movie just because it's an exact replica of one of my favorite books with every single word and detail included, then you are absolutely right. Let me just make some popcorn and get some drinks. We're going to be here a while, folks. Your Honor, in my defense, who cares? Like, OMFG, who cares? Like, come on. Just come on. Today I learned that the King of Prussia had a personal army of 3,000 tall men and admitted, The most beautiful girl or woman in the world would be a matter of indifference to me. But tall soldiers, they are my weakness. <sighs> the few and short soldier. Mm. Hey, hey, hey. It's okay, but McGeans. We respect short kings around here. You good. Hey, you think you're a better kisser than me? You think you're a better cuddler? Then come over here and prove it, Andy. I mean, bunk. I'm gonna deck your halls, bub. There needs to be an easier way to convey the idea of it's absolutely fine that you don't like this thing I like, and I don't even necessarily disagree with your reasons for disliking it, but I am sick to death of hearing your negative opinions about it. Seriously, we need a word for this. We don't have to make one up. Smorbo. Smorbo. Old movies are just gifts that people played music over to make it look. <laughs> Why is this true? <laughs> nah, man, I can't come over tomorrow. I'm gonna listen to songs and think about characters. Y yeah, no, it's gonna be all day. Yeah. A midsummer night's dream, but Oberon keeps Puck on one of those kitty backpack leashes. Alright, stop! This is the best thing ever. I need to see it. I was cleaning my house this afternoon. How nostalgic it is to remember the past years. Forgotten ambitions. Broken dreams. Ancient treasures and the constant reminder that we are now... Adults. Fuck. I'm not sure why, but the words Blessed Be Snom came to my mind and I thought I would share it. Hell yeah. Also, whoever submitted this, I like your gradients, G. You know, thinking about it, I'm pretty sure my ancestors would be horrified with me. Not because I'm lazy or unworthy or anything like that. But because one of my distant uncles was among the eight survivors of the Essex, the ship that inspired the ending of Moby Dick, and sank after being rammed by a whale. And what do I fucking do after my bloodline has this ordeal at sea? I get a fucking degree in marine science and go back the fuck out there. OP, it's your job to kill that whale. There are many benefits to being a marine biologist. I respect that fantasy as a genre has simply refused to standardize the spelling of fairy. Fairy, fae, fi, fair, folk, fairy. Just an F followed by whatever vowels you have in your heart. Furries. Which really just sounds like the Boston way of saying fairies. Hey, don't go in that forest out there. You'll see a bunch of fairies. <laughs> March! Okay! Zootopia? Why? I don't know what the context of this is, and I'm mildly afraid to ask. The weirdest critique I ever got as a kid was when I made some time skip fan designs of some characters. Someone said, um, didn't three years pass? Why is their hair so short? Did it not grow at all? <laughs> Nobody disagreed. And I realized they all collectively forgot. Haircuts exist. Yep. He's my comfort character. Then comfort him. He's drowning in indescribable emptiness right about now. 
No, he's not done marinating. He chews for the angst. <laughs> you don't choose who you fall in love with or when. One day you're just spending time with someone, and suddenly you realize that the slug is watching. Oh, God damn it! here we go again with more indecipherable Tumblr memes I don't understand yet. <laughs> hey. What are your pronouns? Oh, shoot. Uh, um, uh, I, I'm not home right now. Andy, could you water my pronouns for me? It's the he-they ones over there in the corner. Yeah. And stop. Today I learned there is a species of fungus that only exists in Texas and rural Japan. And it is thought to have been in both places for 19 million years. Hmm. Turns people into cowboys or samurais, depending on which place you're in. Well, that explains why cowboy movies and samurai movies are so similar. Too many books? I believe the phrase you're looking for is not enough bookshelves. Yes. You know, bisexuality ain't that hard to understand. Girls are cute. Guys are cute. What more do you want from me? I want your wallet. Even if you don't like Halloween, you have to appreciate its position as the sole thing keeping Christmas from advancing even further into the year like a cancerous growth. The goth kids hold the line. No, I'm not tired of being nice. And yes, I still just want to go ape shit. These things can coexist. Stop asking me. If I don't ever meet a cowboy who calls me darling and tenderly puts his hat on my head and offers a respectful hand to help me onto his horse, then what the fuck even is the point of it all? <laughs> I'm gonna go on a great cowboy fighting adventure, BRB. I don't know who needs to hear this, but I sure did. You can and absolutely should modify the chore slash self-care task if it makes life easier. Sit on the floor while doing laundry. Clean dishes while in a chair. Sit in the shower. Save your spoons. Accommodate your fatigue rather than fighting it. Why have I never thought about this before? Hey babe, wake up. New incomprehensible Tumblr bullshit just dropped. PS5, Life Slug Reaction, Horse Blinko, Blorbo for my shows, Glub Shido, and EBDB. Seriously, what the fuck is live slug reaction? You've heard of be gay do crimes. Now get ready for be trans throw hands. Be queer and still fear. Be bi, go for the eye. Be pan, end it with a bang. Be ace, punch face. Bitches be like, I'm so tired and sleepy. And then stay up doing hyperfixation shit for the next five hours. Wait. No, no, no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. This isn't happening. A hundred thousand no. Not sure on what to say when the room is silent? Try doing a random animal noise. In my next life, I would like to be a lesbian couple's house cat. Why wait, though? Uh, excuse me? Demi boys need to speak louder. I can't hear them. I'm sure you've heard this before, but do you tell jokes to make people laugh or to make people think you're funny, Bucket Show? Neither, I just say things that make myself smile. This is the best mindset. Hey, how many redesigns has each character gone through? <sighs> Too many. And I don't even like talking about the old designs anymore, so please stop bringing them up! You know, striking a blow against the capitalist fetishization of productivity by devoting enormous and elaborate effort to something utterly pointless. Who's in? Remember alls are the most useless things in the entire magical realm. They don't do anything except make you confused and upset. For those of you still wondering, Neville forgot his robe. Well, I can cross that off my list of random questions that still bother me. Oh my god, the sweet relief! I have tasted space! I can feel the power coursing through me! Oh god, I feel awful. I thought for a while that the gods were punishing me, but now I feel like it's something else. Something more sinister. It's me. A where nothing has changed, but the eye of Sauron is just one giant googly eye glued to the top of the tower. Okay, so this picture is good, but uh, I feel like we can go one step further. What if we just did an actual snippet of the Tower of Sauron with a giant googly eye on it? Well, if only some sort of handsome, devilishly charming editor could possibly edit this for us for about five seconds right now. For Sauron will have dominion. Andy? I'm going to make a new font called Times New Bastard. It's Times New Roman, but every seventh letter is jarringly sans serif. Behold. 
Time's new bastard. With one line, you activated every bone in my body, and all of them are in attack mode! Earth, you are my wishing star. Here's how you look from my home on the surface of Mars. You are my wishing star is so romantic. Why is the Mars rover so slick? I am afraid of people who reblog things with no tags. Not even any identifiers like the show it's from or anything. Just silence. What are you thinking? Hello? No thoughts. Just quick reblog. I am not thinking. Well, you know what? Understandable. Have a good day. I love when the gender options are male, female, and prefer not to answer. Like it just reads as boy, girl, and hey, what are you, cop? I don't owe you anything. Beep, pop, bam, look at the slam. Wait, where's the lamb, OP? OP? Where's the lamb? You know, my favorite trope is janitor in headphones continues cleaning through extreme action. I've been the janitor in headphones, and trust me, it's an act. We just don't want to be involved in the nonsense. Yeah, probably. I diagnose you with the weight of living. I'm sorry. You know, Tumblr's not as cringe as it used to be. I'm gonna start shipping bloggers. No, 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 stop, 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 stop. No, bad, bad. And he hit him with the newspaper, bad. Thanks to all the radio signals and noise that the human race is making, to an outside observer, the Earth is sprinting around the sun, screaming. <laughs> No wonder why the aliens don't want to talk to us. No phone, I did not miss a call. I watched it ring the whole time. <laughs> I never make the same mistake twice. I make it five or six times just to be sure. Yeah. You know, some old fella came up to me at work and asked a question, only he didn't quite figure out if he should call me sir or ma'am. By the time he got to the end of his sentence and in a moment of apparent panic, he ended up saying, Captain, instead. Absolutely made my day. Petition to call non-binary people, Captain. <sighs> Worst part of original writing is getting hung up on your own lore. I miss fan fiction where I could look it up on a wiki and get five answers and ignore them all to make up my own thing because canon is stupid. To be frank, didn't OP like create a ludicrous amount of lore when they did write fanfic? Okay, let's not bring up the corporate structure of Wayne Enterprises into this. That's different because reasons. Okay, but didn't also OP make a spreadsheet of all the things that make Bruce Wayne sad, both as a fic and as a reference? Okay, listen! Tumblr HQ setting up a lemonade stand to save the website. Tumblr's doomed. Unless we put on the best talent show this side of the internet has ever seen! Oh great, so it's just sing, but Tumblr. Wait, 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 wait. If the horse is in the Plinko and the horse is in the hospital, then the Plinko is in the children's hospital. And that's why there's color theory, hence the phrase, you can't beat a dead horse. I'm, I'm sorry, what? Why does this, why does this make sense, but also not make sense? Fucking why? This post is brought to you by Killshare. Destroy the website of your dreams with tear space. Get the worst sleep of your life with the Hurdle Mattress. Send malware and DDoS attacks with Horde VPN. And shred your balls with Manscraped! <clears throat> Raid Shadow Legends. Was in London a week ago and I saw a global theater production company of Macbeth doing their vocal warm-ups, and they were just standing on stage rhythmically shouting FUCK 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 at the top of their lungs in perfect unison for 30 seconds. So that's what's going on in the Globe Theater these days. Just thought y'all should know. Andy, can you go to the Global Theater and, you know, confirm this knowledge for me, or is, is that too much? <laughs> Apologies for the warning, but there's got to be at least one trans woman named Eve out there whose dead name is Adam, and she is the funniest person to ever grace this earth with her presence. I feel so appreciated. <gasps> We found her! Andy, kill the fireworks and confetti! The unhappy end of many a popular novel is when it is made into a movie. The Daily Times, New Philadelphia, Ohio, July 9, 1924. Man, the 1920s had it right. Yeah, just on that one, probably just on that one thing, though. Do not attempt. <laughs> Listen, if I had the chance to race Godzilla on four-wheelers, you wouldn't be able to fucking stop me. I hate... The fact that art takes time. What do you mean I can't make a fully rendered piece in two to five minutes? Fuck this.
I wish all the pee came out in one go, like a shotgun blast. That would be absolutely terrifying to hear in a bathroom. You just go in and you just hear, Hey! Multiplies you by one. Ugh! I'm the exact same, but a process has occurred. I hate it! Actually, being silly is one of the greatest joys in life. If you see me in the street meowing back at cats I see and kicking snow piles down, know that I am living my best life. Yeah. Two asexual sitting in a tree. S-I-T-T-I-N-G. Please call the fire department, we're stuck. I love being a fan of media. Your favorite character shows up on screen or page and you're just like, <gasps> Hi, baby! Baby! Baby, it's you. I'm so proud of you. That is absolutely how I felt with Kid Cosmic. <laughs> Can't imagine what it's like to consume media like a normal person. To discover something you enjoy, go, oh, I love that. And then just move on and not spend the next six months of your life literally thinking about nothing else. TikTok is convincing too many hot people that they're funny. And they're not even hot, they're just white. <laughs> Sorry, this is just too good to say previous tags. A or Sienna is a set of quintuplets and they open a burger joint. Called Five Size. So their slogan would be Five Size Burgers and Fries? A. Three things are infinite. The universe, human stupidity, and my desire to buy new books. Yeah, it's a very good point. But also, whoever submitted this, why is the picture so crunchy? If you ever find a genie and you're really craving a dessert that looks like a this, do not say, I'd like a lifetime supply of raspberry crowns. While this is in fact the name of the pastry, it's also the name of a species of wasp for some reason. The genie, being a nasty trickster, will no doubt give you a bunch of wasps. This is oddly specific post, are you okay? The problem with horror shows is that there's no men in little tank tops and booty shorts. Look at this. Peak character design. Dead by daylight, why are you sleeping on this shit? Character. Says I like bread that one time. Fandom. Character has an obsession with bread. Bread is character's true love. Draws character as bread. Every meta joke and fanfic is about bread. The character's room is full of paper with bread. Remus Lupin didn't even eat the fucking chocolate. My mitochondria clearly aren't working because this bitch has no fucking energy. Mitochondria machine broke. Okay, so actually the funny thing is is that this post is basically describing what researchers now think is the underlying cause in chronic fatigue syndrome. As in there is notable dysfunction in mitochondria. That means less ATP is produced, especially under stresses. Well, this bitch empty. Are you?